Good day learners, this is Easy Engineering. This time we're going to talk about periodic table of elements. The periodic table of elements is a tabular display of the chemical elements. It is arranged by atomic number, electron configuration, and recurring chemical properties. It was in 1869 that a Russian chemist, Dmitry Mendeleev, published the first recognizable periodic table. In this video, we will be familiarizing the periodic table of elements. Generally, every cell in the periodic table contains the information of an element. These are its symbol, atomic number, name of the element, atomic mass, and many more depending on the periodic table that you are using. Elements are arranged in periods and groups. There are 7 rows of the table which are called periods and 18 columns are called groups or families. Each group contains elements with similar properties. Groups are divided into A and B. Its trivial names are Group 1A is called alkali metals which are very reactive and electropositive. Group 2A is called alkali earth metals which are all shiny and silvery white in appearance and somewhat reactive metals at standard temperature and pressure. Group 3A is called trails, which are characterized by having three valence electrons. Group 4A is called tetrals, which are characterized by having four valence electrons. Group 5A is called nectogens, which comes from the Greek word that refers to the choking property of nitrogen. Group 6A is, is called chalcogens, which comes from Greek word chalcos, that means or formers. Group 7A is called halogens which comes from Greek word meaning salt producing. Group 8A is called noble gases which refers to the inert gases and they are very stable that makes them extremely non-reactive. For groups B, they are called transition metals from group 1B copper group, 2B zinc group, 3B scandium group, 4B titanium group, 5B Vanadium Group, 6B Chromium Group, 7B Manganese Group, and 8B composed of Iron Group, Cobalt Group, and Nickel Group. There are also elements which are separated but still are included in Group 3B. These are called Lanthanide, series located in Period 6, and Actinide, series located in Period 7. According to their shared physical and chemical properties, the elements can be classified into major categories of metals, metalloids, and nonmetals. The elements boron, silicon, germanium, arsenic, antimony, tellurium, and polonium are called metalloids. Elements above the line formed by metalloids are nonmetals, including hydrogen. And lastly, the rest are all metals. And that's it. I hope you learned something today. Once again, this is Easy Engineering.